and welcome to Home Simply Home. In today's video, I will be selling my kitchen island seven different ways. I hope this gives you some ideas and inspiration on how to decorate your own kitchen island or countertops for spring. In this first look, I tried to go with a more cottage-like style, which I have enjoyed over the last couple of years. I just love the charming and simplistic feel it gives. I purchased the gray tray from Hobby Lobby and the vintage-looking pot from HomeSense. All of the florals came from Hobby Lobby, and they are a mixture of hydrangeas, lilacs, and the small flowers remind me of Queen Anne's Lace. I think they pair beautifully together. The candle and the pepper grinder and salt shaker set are from Target. next style, I use a wooden charcuterie board I purchased from Walmart. I have this watering can from Target and added these beautiful tulips from Amazon. I just love the look of this. I am also adding this beautiful cloche I found at TJ Maxx. I love how the gold accents on it tie back with the watering can. To the cloche, I am going to add this candle as well. I also found these marble and wooden coasters at Home Goods. I think this style is very simple yet elegant. less is more approach with this option. I am restyling this vintage looking pot from HomeSense and adding the beautiful white tools from Amazon. It makes such a beautiful but simple statement.
for is another simple styling on a much larger scale. I purchased this vase from World Market a few years back and these stems are from Amazon. In style number five, I will keep the green stems and the large vase, and I'm just going to add a dough bowl from Hobby Lobby with some fresh pears. I love having an easy place for my family to grab some fruit, plus it doubles as decor. I also purchase and use some faux fruit. I have found some realistic options on Amazon. In style number six, I am adding a tobacco basket, which I purchased from Hobby Lobby. Next, I am adding this jug-like vase that I got from Hobby Lobby and paired it with these beautiful dogwood stems. I think I got these at Big Lots several years ago. I also added this ceramic white bowl from Walmart and I decided to style the pears again for this look. I love how this style came together and using this tobacco basket brings such warmth and interest to my island. last and final style I used another small wooden board and then I added this gorgeous pottery stone look vase from Hobby Lobby. I decided to cut some stems from our crab apple tree that is blooming in our yard and place them in the vase. This is just so beautiful. Don't be afraid to use something from your yard or nature. 
also added this green candle again. much for watching today. I hope you enjoyed this video and got lots of ideas and inspiration on different ways that you can sell your kitchen island. I really enjoyed making this video and playing around with the different ideas. Please share with me which style you liked best and which one you think I should use on my island down in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video today, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And if you haven't already, I would greatly appreciate it if you would subscribe as I try and grow my channel and then you will be notified of any of my new content. Have a wonderful week and we will see you in the next one.